Recently, we took some time to examine the Muffinzeef Modular Deviant, a dirty stepped random source module. The predecessor to Deviant is the genetically modified oscillator, or GMO. The GMO is an open source Arduino based sample player with panel and CV control over sample selection, pitch and speed, start and endpoints, and looping. The module employs 8 bit samples, giving it a unique, gritty, lo fi sound. GMO holds samples in flash memory, so individual samples are not very easy to swap out. To make things easier on users, Muffinzeef has recompiled the GMO firmware with dozens of additional sample packs, including hand percussion samples, classic drum machines, and my personal favorite, farts. There are also 10 artist kits, including great sample banks from some friends of ours, Basek and Detroit Underground. Installing these sample libraries is easy since the GMO is built on a Teensy microcontroller. First, let's go to the GMO GitHub page at github.com slash modular slash GMO. You should see a big green button on the right side of the page that says clone or download. Click it and select download zip. You'll also need the Teensy loader application, which will send the firmware to the module at pjrc.com slash teensy slash loader.html. Leaving the module powered on, I'll carefully remove it from the case and connect the micro USB cable between the Teensy jack and my computer. I'll load the Teensy application and locate the GMO folder in my downloads folder. In the hex files folder, we'll see all of our sample folders as well as the two alternate firmwares, Bobcat and Mongrel. I'll drag the BASIC artist hex file to the Teensy app. Pressing the tiny button on the Teensy, the firmware should be flashed to it automatically. If not, hit the auto button in the loader app. I'll disconnect the USB cable, return the module to the rack, and route a gate sequence to the bang input, and a cable from the output to the mixer. We should hear the new set of samples playing back. We can repeat the process easily now. This time I'll load the tabla samples. The alt firmware versions can be installed the same way. I've taken a particular liking to the mongrel, which ring modulates two lo-fi sine or square waves. As you can see, this mode reveals some extremely interesting texture. More on mongrel in a future video. Thanks again to Muffinzeef Modular for helping me finally find a way to work farts into a video. How are you making your modular system fart? Tell us about it in the comments. Thanks for watching and sharing. As always, please like, follow, and subscribe. And remember, patch smarter.